is looking into the city of WGN 9 News Part 5 of the Winter Vortex that what they're warmed up. In and Illinois and across the United States of America. Making sure that they're keeping people updated on the outages and when they expect power to be restored. When you take into consideration how, how cold it is, you know, record-breaking cold and so on, the last thing that you want to hear is a, a power outage that, uh, that affected about 22,000 people at the height of it. Now, now thankfully, that, that was uh, um, relatively quickly restored. I know it's, not, it's, it's never fast enough, especially in weather like this, and we certainly understand that. Some good news, though. ComEd is saying that, or at least they're telling the city, that a lot of the power should be restored to the remaining 300 people probably before 6 o'clock, which, of course, as you just heard the city spokesperson say, will not be soon enough for a lot of those people. We're in Aurora. I'm Eric Rung, WGN News. Okay, Eric, thank you. Still to come from the newsroom tonight, not everybody is worried about the deep freeze. WGN's Bob Jordan has a little fun in the winter weather. Plus, the big question, when will things start warming up? Well, Tom Skelling's back with a seven-day forecast. What did Skelling